just make sure that that didn't fuck up the recording. You never know. It usually doesn't, but there's one time I did something like that. Um, in Season 3 of World of Warcraft back in, like, um, what was it? Uh, back in Netherstorm, and it fucked up my entire recording for that session. It usually does it, but it occasionally it can, and I'm not going to take that chance. You know, I just, I don't feel like taking that risk today. God, this fucking hurt, man. You just do constant streams of damage. Either when they attack or when you attack. Mithril, cause why not? Mithril sells pretty well. A couple gold, you know. Okay. That's fucking crit, dude. Beautiful crit. Okay, I think we're safe to just ride back up and tear down these quests. Because hopefully two quests will give us one bar of experience. I would imagine so. If not, um, what the fuck? It would be my response to that. Aegis Hunters, Melee, AQ, E, blah blah blah. I think people that are fucking elitist about, like, uh, we, we specifically want these classes for this raid and stuff is just stupid. You can be any raid with any class. You do not have to be. Do not have to be specific. Like, oh, we need exactly three mages and two hunters and blah blah. Fuck it. No. What? Uh, but yeah, that uh, that 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 raid is next. I imagine. I think that's the only range that, that are left. Um, I think there are two there. I can't remember. I feel like once it was two. Maybe it's just one at that place. I can't recall. But it's, uh, it's the one over here in Silthus. Oh, I was like, Silthus? Oh, yeah, it's the one that's over here. Which is good, because if that's coming out, then that means we at least have several months uh, available to us before uh, they start even thinking about doing anything with like Burning Crusade and shit. Which is good. That makes me happy. Look at that. 21 points away from maxing out mining. Hell yeah. Be our first skill ever maxed out. And fucking... Classic World of Warcraft. That'd be fucking beautiful, man. You got my attention. That ugly girl. Oh, that's not nice. Alright. Don't experience. There we go. Awesome. Oh, and Lufa. Lose one bleed effect. It's actually kind of nice. Actually, has a three minute cooldown? Fuck yeah, dude. Hey, good. Quipping that. Quipping that. Like, get out of here. That Lufa's going on. Sorry, stopwatch, but like, fucking Lufa's got you beat. Um. Keep it right for a moment just to see. Feeling. Keep the mage cleave, of course. Um. Wow, 67 minutes in this order. Interest you on the fight? Oh, so so Here there. Yeah. Alright. Sell these for some moolah. I'm to keep those spiderwebs just in case. Uh, 87. Or 82 for 67 scales. It's actually not too shabby. That might be why that little 60 was there. For the money. Hey, we're almost back to 30 gold. 
motherfucker, we spent like 20 of it on a bunch of shit. <laughs> What's <laughs> like, happening? Like getting, becoming an armorsmith and getting new armor uh, 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 upgrades and stuff and all that good shit. Alright. So, about half a bar to 11 bars in, as we suspected. Now! Got five fucking quests. We'll have four quests after this. That's not looking good. Um. Now we are going to fly over to the booty, the bay, and either attempt to solo message in a bottle, or find a group. Either if we find a group pretty fast, before we get the chance to run over there and try to solo it, or if we go and try to solo it and we get our ass kicked, and then we have no choice but to look for a group. One of those two. So I will see you guys hopefully over in Stranglehorn Bale. Ah, right, people, we're back. As you can see, I got a person in my group. Now, I don't know if I could solo King of Queen. And I don't know if we're going to get anyone else to do it. Um, but with one other person, it should be feasible. Now, this person is at level 47. But it's also a mage. Mages are pretty fucking ridiculous. Uh, so if no one else answers the call, I'm definitely going to try it with two. It, it all just depends if this person rolls with the crew or not. If this person doesn't roll with the crew, I should... Well, you should be able to handle it. Like, it should be no problem. Uh, but if he rolls with the crew, we could... We could run into a problem. We could run into an issue. I'm going to pop my Righteous Fury. Um, just so uh, I can try to keep as much aggro on myself as possible. Keep this uh, 52 Elite. Which is going to be red. To Stellar Wind. Which sucks, but... It's, it's better than soloing. Yeah. Um... Yeah, see if I can keep this 52 Elite on the person wearing full plate instead of the person wearing all cloth. That would probably be uh, the best. Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about. 50, Jesus. Okay, well, that will do it. That's Fucking. <sighs> okay, well, never mind. Duh. Anyone know what this beast is? Oh, it's a fire mage. That's interesting. The only way I know... Well, first off, fire vulnerability is a giveaway. But it's like, the only way I know he's a fire mage is because no fucking frost mage would cast a fire spell. <laughs> it would, it's just a waste of mana. Uh, so yeah, I was gonna say, like, oh, fucking... <laughs> you might be able to do it, and then someone whispered me, and it happens to almost be a level 60. So you know what, now I'm pretty fucking that positive. Isn't ready yet. We can do it. Oh, no. God, if I keep missing attacks... Then yeah, he's gonna whoop my friend. He's my little friend over his ass. Boom, heal up, and then I was gonna drink, but this okay, he's crane push this for himself, that's fine. Uh those guys like before I drink mine, like you ain't got any yours, like let me know. Chances are I won't keep aggro from this priest, but a muckster is gonna be green to the priest, so I don't think uh I don't think it's gonna be a problem. Plus I'm doing it more as a generous uh, offering uh, because I do have the ability I might as well put used to it when I should be taking the hits over the cloth wearers uh, you know, it's just kind of general rule of thumb <laughs> um, so yeah I guess we're gonna kick Mukla's ass y'all I, I don't know where Mukla is but I assume he's somewhere here with all the real ones um, 
face for you and the most of the family. The great Sky Main King, look like it's my captain. You can ask the of love and they keep me here. Found him! <laughs> oh, he's actually 51? What? Oh, yeah, because if he was 52, right, it would have. It would still be. It would still be orange. Right, he's 51 elite. Okay. I was like, what? That's not right. But I'm like, oh, no, never mind. It is. Yeah, no, that makes sense that this dude would be your captor. Fucker's giant. Um. Hi, hi, bud. Uh, and I shouldn't have to worry about healing. So that's good. Wow, he did prayer for you, dude. This guy's. This guy's real serious. Actually, let's. Yeah, let's heal and drink. Might as well. Like, let's get fucking ready for this big fight. Shouldn't be a problem. We have a fucking 58 priest. I just keep his aggro on me and we should be fucking fine. Right? <laughs> Is that the way you Okay. We gotta take this guy first. Yeah, no. No, we're gonna fucking destroy. <laughs> King Mucknasty isn't gonna stand a chance. So. Let's go, son. Again, I don't know if he rolls with a crew. But we're gonna find out. Aren't we? Alright, that should be more than enough to hold aggro. If I'm going to hold aggro. If that doesn't do it, I'm not gonna hold aggro. <laughs> um, so we'll just attack. Yeah. I don't. I'm trying to look, because I have healing going on. Okay, he does quite a bit of damage, and I don't think I would do nearly as much as I would have. Um. I I might have with I would say with uh, I'd say I don't I, I don't know if I would have been able to take Makla alone. Yeah, fair enough. Fair enough. It's all good. It's all good. Um, I might have been, but I would have. I mean, I would probably would have been guaranteed. Divine shield, lay on hands, necessary uh, to be able to do it. So. How may I aid you? Walk with Thank you for your misery. Mind. May the winds. Oh. Yep. Peace, man. All right. Well, that's done. That gave us actually. Yeah, that was seven and a half thousand. That gave us a bar and a half. So that gives a bar and a fucking half. Um, so we are now at. Uh, oh, 12 bars in. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. We are down to four quests. We absolutely <laughs> need to um, need to see. Uh, we absolutely need to see. Or first off, get to level 50. And within like two more quests, like, well, actually, it'll be th well, yeah, it'll be probably three, unless we can just do it off of these two. I don't think we can, but you never know. Um, which we'll probably try these first. We're down. We're down to four quests, guys. We are almost bone fucking dry on quests. So that's um, that's, that's no record. Uh, but of course, as always, I'll probably look into like, where the other quests are if they spawn after doing some of these quests, so I'll know if we have quests coming at the end of this. Um, and whatnot. I think our ability to solo people is going to increase greatly from levels 51 to 53. Uh, mostly because we're going to have a chance to reduce uh, enemies' um, strength and agility for 10 seconds at a time um, if it procs. And that's going to be by 15% at level 3. Um, so I think that that would be... If we could re reduce the damage that they do, while well, we already have pretty... Um, well, we already have pretty low... A uh, pretty, a uh, pretty, pretty decent damage reduction, straight up from. Um, How are you? Uh, 
enough of just wearing the plate in general, then we should be fine. I'm pretty sure I can use forges to cook with. I think I've done that before. No? Aw. Oh. I feel like I've done that before. Oh well. I guess I was mistaken. <laughs> Uh, 30 and a half gold. That's a beautiful sight. I always like it when I have over 20. Uh, uh, gold over the 20s. That always makes me feel better. It's not a lot. But hey, it's over 20 gold. I'll take it. Uh, I'm going to dump some stuff off in my... Uh, someone has a cooking fire here, right? Because I don't think it's... A, no. Yo. I dub some stuff off of my, my bank. A five pack is spendy. <laughs> 40 fucking silver. But it's alright. It's alright. It's all part of the price to pay. Um, There we go. Here's a cooking fire. Stove. Make some more of these spider sausages. Potentially get a point up. Boom. Point up in our cooking. Do I see two? I see two. Fuck yeah. Get fucking motherfucking wrecked. Uh, let's dump the rest of this off in our bank. Our heavily filling that bank. Because uh, mm, I don't want to tangle from the motherfucking slot. I uh, need to see if I can set a solid stone. Do something with a solid stone. Because it's, it's driving me crazy. I think first things first. I want to make probably four of these to get rid of that just that four chunk. There's no reason to have that there. Uh, clear out some space here. I did use I don't know if I did this on camera or not, but I did clear out uh, I did use that wolf meat that we got from killing the wolves in the blast lands and whatnot to create some of these tender wolf steaks, which is uh, right up here in uh, Kuku. Uh, can't, I don't think I did that on camera. I think I sold them and then I bought them back, being like, wait, I can use this. And all that, so I think that's what happened. Um, iron spider web. We don't need thick spider web stuff. We'll put the black diamond up in here. And move that like that. Perfecto. Uh, star rubies. We got a few of those. Got some there. Keep the nifty stopwatch just in case I can always equip it to myself. And then use it as speakers, then de equip it for myself. And I'll go through his 30 minute cooldown, I believe. So, there is that. And I also moved my Lufa over here because it's right next to Cleanse. Yeah, you know, Cleanse, Poison, Disease, Magic, and Bleed. Like, that's pretty fucking good. Uh, so, yeah, that can take a lot of damage over time off of me, which is also increasing my ability to self-sustain. Um, so that's, that's pretty cool. English. Smell some good cooking. Alright. Um, Glad I could help. So yeah, we'll look into quests and whatnot, see what see what's going on, see, uh, remind myself again what the earliest level I can dip into um, burning Steve's is. Uh, I feel like I said 50. Uh, well, I feel like before I thought 50. But now that I'm looking at it, I was like, well, no, maybe that was 52, because, like, uh, 50 seemed a little early. So I, I, I'm, I'm questioning myself. I'll have to look at that, see what, see what the case is, see what the deal is. We, we stock back up on that. Uh, oh, about to get a buff. That's interesting. I don't need it, but we're going to get it. So let's keep that on us for next time. Um... And uh, yeah, then we'll come back, see uh, see what we got, see what we can do. Maybe we come back and, I don't know, grind those uh, those eight bars. I don't know. We'll, we'll just, it'll just depend on what kind of quests and shit we get. Uh, so thank you for joining me, and I will see you guys next time.